Oh. Oh. Put your finger, don't touch it. I'm not going to touch it. I'm not gonna if touch you're going to touch it, grab it with a leap. We just found a... What's up guys, I'm Osarji, welcome back to another video. Today I'm doing something completely new to my channel and something I've been wanting to try out for a little while. So you guys know that a few weeks back I actually came to Al Capone's hideout which is this house behind me right here. A lot of the locals that are from this area know that this was Al Capone's Canadian hideout where he used to come and hide out from the cops whenever he'd done something bad or during prohibition and all that stuff. Today I'm gonna be doing a... <laughs> Today I'm gonna be doing a metal detecting video in Al Capone's Hideout. We want to see if we can find some things that were probably buried or left behind. A lot of you guys were requesting this video and if you guys want me to do more metal detecting videos, let me know in the comments below and actually let me know if you guys know of any really good metal detectors. I just purchased this one off Amazon for like $200 so hopefully it's good. I've never done this before. Smash the like button. Now without further ado, let's get on with this adventure. We gonna get some! Hey guys, welcome back to another haunted video. What the hell is going on, man? I'm scared. Show me what it can do. What's up guys, my name is Mo Sarji, so unfortunately there isn't going to be a cartoon movie just yet. That's right guys, the video clip that you just saw was only a taste of the real thing. We're creating a Kickstarter to make this movie a reality and we need your support. Hey guys, Rennie here. Our goal is to create a full feature cartoon movie and screen it publicly on Mo Sarji's YouTube channel sometime in February 2021. Creating a full scale cartoon is very labor intensive. It is not easy to do and takes a lot of effort. You need the right people to do it and also the right equipment. We want to make this movie a reality, but like Mo already said, we need your support in order to make this happen. Giving even just one dollar will create a positive impact and bring us closer to our goal. To those of you who want to and are able to pledge more, there will be incentives. Those incentives are shown on our Kickstarter page. Thank you to everyone and let's make this cartoon a reality. If I do manage to find anything, um, Rennie's gonna dig it up. He's got the shovel. Shovel ready? That's right. Hey Al Capone, did you leave anything behind for us, buddy? A little silver dollars, maybe? Oh, it'd be cool to actually... Oh, I left something. Got something on a window ledge, but there's nothing there on the ledge. Maybe there's iron underneath? The rebar? Probably or nails, yeah, or some mm -hmm. type of. Hey, like look, there's, there's a nail up here. Something. Yeah, see? That's a nail up there. What's it showing? Iron. Well, we know it scans. We don't know what the rest means, but we know it scans. I kind of want to go up into here. Because I don't know, I feel like, like a mobster back in the day would literally just like bury stuff in the backyard. It's about caches in that up or metal. Unless he's got silver or gold buried somewhere. I'd be very, very impressed if we find something really like old, you know, from back in those days. Those of you guys that are skeptic about like, if this actually is Capone's hideout, there's a grocery store down the road from here. Um, what's this place called, Quaysville? Quaysville, yeah. Quaysville or something like that. They have his picture up in the actual grocery store. We can't go there because it's closed because of COVID-19. But if you, you guys can even Google um, Al Capone's Canadian hideout and this is, place will be the first place that pops up and uh, that's why we came out here the first time to do a video. Hey, it looks like somebody dug something here. Yeah. Wait, why is there why is there a hole dug there? It might be from an animal actually. Is it? Hold on, let me see if there's any... Oh, I'm getting something. Or was that the shovel? It might have been the shovel. Yeah, that was probably the yeah. shovel. Hmm. I wonder if somebody came. Wait a sec, we seen kids. When we parked on the road, we yeah, seen kids. people nearby. They had a shovel, they had a camera, mm -hmm. they had a bucket. A bucket? Yeah, they had a bucket with them. They were like, maybe they were digging for something. All right, guys, we're about to go inside of. Uh, no. <laughs> Got it backwards. What? Huh? No, I'm vlogging with it. <laughs> I'm vlogging with it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we're about to go inside of Capone's house using my tripod slash metal detector as a camera. 
<laughs> All right, let's go inside and see if we can maybe find something inside of the house. So we are inside of the house right now and we're getting a lot of readings from the floor, most likely nails. So look at that, we're getting a lot of... That's the thing, there has to be a way for us to differentiate between nails so iron and anything is... else. Yeah, it says there's iron, so there's gotta be some nails or some metal beams in here somewhere. Okay, from, did you leave us anything? Be nice if you left us something to find. Keep in mind guys, this place has been abandoned for what, like 100 years or more? Probably long, long. Yeah, but how many people have taken metal detectors inside this place? We thought it came over here. Honestly, I don't know what to expect to find. Like, you never know. We might find something cool. We might not. Oh, that's a big I think our best bet is to be looking outside. I was gonna say, even if we find anything in here, how are we supposed to get it out? We have a shovel, not a pickaxe. Yeah, and I'm not gonna pickaxe this place. Exactly. We're still in the learning phase over here. It's kind of cool because like, we've never done this before. <laughs> I'm pretty sure most people go metal detecting outdoors. Yeah, not <laughs> indoors. <laughs> but I mean, it's kind of cool because this is an Alcapone's hideout, right? I'm sure people want to see more of this place. I say in the backyard area is where we're going to find all the good stuff, if there is anything left behind. Keep in mind, there's a big floor. So we're going to find something, I guarantee. So, oh, what's here? Hey, Renny, we got something here. Yeah. Get that shovel over here, boy. Here? Yeah. Right in this area here. It says it's nickel. Oh, you know what it is? What? The outer rim of this hole. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's metal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's yeah. metal. You just gotta be patient, that's all. <laughs> what if mushrooms are metal mushrooms? Salad or something like that. Oh, we got something here. What's this? Wrap. This is what I don't think that's what it got. Oh, start digging. Yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah. Look dig, here. Dig, dig. Oh, here. What does it say? It says iron. Oh, whoa, whoa. What the f is that? Nah. What is that? A bracelet? No way. Is that a bracelet? Is that what, what is I was it? picking up? Hold on. Put it down. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. What yeah. Look it at say? that. Yeah. It says AG okay. aluminum. Aluminum bracelet. Here, hold that. I mean, it's not that old. Somebody might have been here and lost this. Yeah. Yeah. It's old, but not that old. Anyone want a bracelet? I'm gonna leave that right here because it's not mine. That's cool. We found a bracelet. I, I want something better though. Like, imagine finding like money. Wait, is AG silver or aluminum? Because that's a big difference. Okay, because if that's silver, <laughs> we're gonna have to. That's worth after. a lot. <laughs> Hold on. I mean, it doesn't look like silver. I say let's take it with us. Nah, bro. That's like. I'll put something on the screen that says what it is. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so that yeah. Way we know. <laughs> no, this looks like it's like aluminum or something. A really yeah. hard type of aluminum. <laughs> right, yeah. Aluminum? Or yeah, stainless right. steel or something. <laughs> Alright, he can keep it. You want it, you can keep it. It's not like this place, anyone's ever going to come back or this place has been abandoned for a long time. Oh, we're getting something over here. I'm not sure if it's this wire, but it's saying it's iron. I'm not sure if it's the wire. Hey, look at this. I'm telling you, man, we're bound well, to that's... find some good stuff here. Keep pulling. <laughs> I don't know. That's it. What's at the end of the rope? What the hell? Oh, I'm still getting some beats, so I'll start digging over here. Here, let's see. Where you're digging is where the strongest signal is. Okay. What's that? What's oh, that's that? what we're getting. It's a piece of metal. Yeah. It's just rotted out metal. Look at that. Yeah. Damn! That's actually cool. We found a, another piece of metal. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thanks. Dump that on my shoe, Renny. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? You know how to use a shovel? <laughs> <laughs> what if, uh, we, what if you find like... Nothing? What if that bracelet belonged to like a body of a woman or something? Oh, God. By the way, I had a fan like get really mad because they said Al Capone wasn't a criminal. Bitch, please. Al Capone was one of the biggest criminals out there. Have you ever heard of the Valentine's Massacre? Yeah, no, you haven't. Probably not. Come on, Randy, keep digging. There's nothing here, man. Oh, here, here, here. Down here. Down there. No, I think. That's why. Oh, it's another. have to dig. It's another piece of that oh, metal. More than that. Oh, what the hell? My shovel is breaking. There's something. more. Found something. Come here. Well, look at that white thing. What is it? It's a toilet flusher. <laughs> Very technical flusher. term. Well, it is. It's a toilet flusher. Whoa, I'm getting something over here. 
I was getting something over here. It's strange because we've been at this for a little while. It looks like a couple of minutes for you guys. But we've actually been at this for over an hour. And we get readings, we dig, and we find nothing. Mm -hmm. Not a... I'm just going to start waving my arm. Like, <laughs> wave it. Isn't that what kind of what they do? Yeah, but like... Imagine find... Oh, oh, oh. Whoa, I was just about to say, imagine finding like a body or something. Here, let me dig, dig out. It's not... Okay. See, Renny, this is how you dig. Hey, Renny, get that um, get that meter on over here. Let's see what's, how far. What's the signal? Uh, 14. Oh, that's like four bars or one bar? Move the it bar. says uh, one bar, a very weak signal. Oh. That's how you dig? <laughs> you <got any> eye? <laughs> no, I don't know what the hell happened. My, my eye just started hurting me for no oh. reason. It wasn't even like dirt. No, no. Yo, I gotta get me an under. No, it's water. here. What? It's under here. But I heard it from here. Yeah, right there. That's your shovel. That's, no, oh, that's okay. the shovel. That's why. <laughs> oh. Oh! oh. I don't even have to dig. Oh, well, that's what it was. Wait, what is it? There's a rusty dumbbell. Huh. Is that what it is? Yeah. Yo, I just thought of something. What if someone like beat someone with a dumbbell? Right? Uh, that was the first that thing. That's cool. Thought, Wouldn't there be blood on it though or something? I mean. They probably cleaned yeah, it. Yeah, you can clean that off. You can clean off blood. I've done it many times. Yeah, me too. To all my haters. <laughs> so that's cool. How much do you think this weighs? Our fingerprints on our on a murder weapon now. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> Don't the go chipmunk. there. Here, let me uh, hold the camera for a bit. All right, let's continue. Do you time. want to go closer to the house or further away? Well, I'd say let's stay out in this vicinity for a little while and see what happens. And then we'll actually move further into the forest because it is a big piece of property. Like if I was a monster and I wanted to bury bodies on my property, I wouldn't do it right beside the house because that's bad omens. Just the fact that this is Al Capone's freaking hideout from back in the day is, is creepy enough. And the fact that we're sitting here metal detecting years and years and years after his death. I said let's go up here there. Yeah, you're right. Probably further away from the house. Yeah, let's go see. You never know. I mean, it would take a long time to completely map out this entire area with that thing. Yeah, exactly. Smash the like button if you guys are enjoying this type of video. Um, if you if you want more, I kind of want to do more because of, I'm kind of getting bored of like, what? Under here. Yeah. Angela, start digging, boy. <laughs> oh, see it, man. You're probably like covering it up with more mud. Probably. Go go back over there. I heard it like go off. Like, oh, here, here. It's under like the log. Are mushrooms metallic? I Wait, there it is. There it is. There it is. Look, a piece of metal right there. Oh. oh. There you go. It's working. A piece of metal. Oh, you know what that could be? Huh. Maybe they strangled somebody with that. It's kind of like barbed wire. Yeah, it, it is barbed wire. It's right? exactly what it is. It's barbed wire uh, hidden in the ground. That's something strange. Is there anything else? Why is there barbed wire in the ground? More. There's more. It would be super hard to strangle someone with barbed wire because you'd probably cut your hands up. Not if you have gloves, Mo. Not if you know what you're doing. Anyways, as I was saying, guys, like, I've been getting really bored. Like, I love doing the haunted videos, but they've been getting kind of boring because, like, everybody on YouTube and their goldfish are making the same videos, same titles, same thumbnails. I want to change it up a little bit. Um, do some metallic finding videos in haunted places and do more magnet fishing videos something that actually you know sometimes inspires me to be creative because once i take a little bit of a break from the haunted i get inspired to do even better videos so i'm going to be mixing it up all the time from now on and if you guys want to subscribe to my other channel the vlog channel the sarji family channel my daughter is about to be born soon and i'm very excited to share that with you guys on that channel so subscribe to that channel um if you guys want to keep up to date with my day-to-day -day -day life basically invest in like two more metal detectors I have a feeling here I might have something cool what you got a spidey sense or something yeah sense I have like a to these things I have like a metallic um, detector so whenever I get excited something gets hard <laughs> So first, first, in my opinion, brush off the leaves off the top, just so it's not surface. Right here. Just so it's not on the surface, you know what I mean? Yeah. And we don't lose it. Okay, this area here. move the shovel away. Yeah. And let me see if I can get anything here. 
Yeah, yeah it's right under there, here. Yeah. Right here, right in that area. I'm not going to just dig too much because we might lose it, whatever it is. Oh, there it is, there it is. What, what is that? No, nothing yet. Oh, really? Oh, it's just a little root. Yeah, it's just a root. It looks shiny from this angle. It's down there. It's by that rock. Yeah. yeah. Maybe it's the rock? That'd no, be weird, no. Oh, yeah. You found it? It's more of that metal shit. Why is it? Yeah, it's what like rusted stuff? pieces of metal. Why is there like these scrap metals here? Yeah. I don't know. I mean, it could be from old barrels that have rotted away over time. Why barrels? Because people back in the day used to use a lot of barrels made of iron and they'd rot away like, really quickly. Look at how weird that mushroom looks. Wow, right? That's cool. So this is the mushroom that grows the sensu beans. You start hallucinating, Alan Joel. You know why? Oh, you got something. Okay, right here in this area. Better not be more of that scrap metal. I have a feeling it probably is. Oh, there's a big rock. Come on. Okay. Come on, Al Capone. Hold on, move, move. Something for a second. Was it the rock? No. That's weird. Just, oh, oh, right here. Okay. Right in this area. Yeah, yeah. It says it's iron. Oh. oh, what the hell? There's no way. What is that? Another rock. That's just your shovel. I should get a better shovel. That's what I'm wondering. <laughs> yeah. All right. Hang on, hang on. There's another rock. Go. Nothing here. That's so strange. Vanished. False alarm. You get that sometimes. Alright, mosquitoes are out in full force. Something gave me a reading. Oh, right here. It? Right here, Rennie. Alright. <coughs> right by this two knock away knock me. Oh, okay. oh, what is that? That's, That's a tree trunk. Tree, yeah. Tree. yeah. Tree trunk yeah. lights matter, so we don't want to hurt that. So Al Capone, you got to do something about these mosquitoes, bro. <laughs> I must say, thus far, I am underwhelmed. We have found a dumbbell, and what else did we find? I don't know. A bracelet. Yeah, and a, bracelet. a bunch of rusted pieces of metal. Yep. Oh, we got that. Oh. Another false alarm. It's a heavy signal. Another tree trunk under here. Just leaves. I don't know. No, move your shovel. Move your shovel. Yeah, right here, right here. Dig that up, let's go. <laughs> dig, my child, dig. Oh, what do we got? No, that's a root. That's a root. What's down there, yeah? Just gotta keep digging. Patience, boys. Right here. Yeah, yeah. Right here. Oh, come on, baby. Give us something. Give us something. Come on, Al Capone. Give us a murder weapon. Give us something a chain. interesting. Give us a necklace. Don't give be us another false alarm. More jewelry. Yeah. Of gold. Wait, wait, stop, stop, stop. <laughs> How deep are we going? It's there. Oh, oh. I'm Maybe it's another yeah. false alarm. <laughs> One good. No, there's a lot of trees. Oh, there. Oh. What is that? Oh, what Ooh. the I just said chain, give us a chain. Oh sh I just said give us a chain. Like a noose. No fu no, no way. There's no way. Dude, I'm freaking out right now. I just said give us a chain. There's well, we no way. We found something finally. There's no way. Yeah. I said give us a chain and he gave us a freaking chain. It's a little bit more interesting than a bracelet. I said give us a chain, give us some jewelry. Now that's a That's bling, bling guys. <laughs> this thing's been here for a long time. Why would anybody bury a chain? What should I do with my finders? Yeah, do you should I finders keep them? keepers? I think people do finders keepers. Really? Yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll I keep kept them. the bracelet. We'll keep them and, and then go throw them in a river. Mm. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. I'm, <laughs> I'm joking. We'll throw them in the garbage, I guess. I mean, if they're worth keeping, we'll keep it. So we'll probably just get that dumbbell after and the mm -hmm. uh -huh. the jewelry. You have the jewelry, right? I have. I the mean, bracelet. you can keep it. You can give it to your girlfriend or something. Girlfriend? Oh, Here's an aluminum Wait, bracelet. There's more. There's, there's more. Oh, there's something else here. Look at that. So there's more. What the hell? Hang on, go deep. That's what she said. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we need to invest in a better shovel, boys. I mean, I literally bought a shovel, but I left it at home, and all I had was this in the car. I bought a brand new, good shovel. Oh. <laughs> I mean, when you dig, you usually don't throw it in your face. Hold on, let me see if there's more. Still it's there. still there. There's something here, man. Oh, right here, right here. It's right here. Here, let me dig, let me dig. Here. 
You've been there good. What the? Okay, bro. There's gotta be some sort of spiritual presence Whoa, here. Whoa, that's weird. That is so weird. Wait, wait, we just dug up a chain? Maybe, that, like, someone got killed with that chain. Oh, maybe. <laughs> it's not our phones going on? off because there's no reception out here. There's literally, look at that. Why is it doing that? Look at that, I got no reception yeah. on my phone yeah, at all. So that actually might be like something spiritual. Yeah, maybe. it's done freaking out. Or something really strong. Spiritual things, they do affect um, uh, electromagnetic items. <laughs> There's no way. What is, is under there? 45 10 cent CU. What's CU? Copper. Copper? Unless there's something even deeper buried here. Could be where the body's buried. Yeah, right. <laughs> God, I'm gonna freak out if I see a body. I've seen one of those before. Or hey, get that. in a pocket. Get that scanner in here. Okay. Not I know sure. I just called the metal detector a scanner, but just. Same thing. Same thing. I'm, I'm new at this metal detecting shit. Nothing. Oh, no. Honestly, guys, I don't know what's going on here. I'm very disappointed now. Your watch, obviously, when you okay. were doing that. Yeah, maybe it was just dirty. Nope. No, there's, there's definitely something there's gotta here. Be something there. It's like somebody dragging something. Yeah. I also heard like a like a ticking noise. Yeah. Like a knocking. More? Yeah. This is always the spot right here. No, there's still something here. Oh yes. Is that what, what a tree sounds like Sorry, when it moves? No, Mo, there's definitely something here. What's going on right here? here too? Some Strongest signal I've ever seen here. 77 right here. I'm getting tired of digging. <laughs> here, switch. Wait, let me see the signal. 58. See you in iron. There's something here. Let's move this. Maybe there's like a, a bunker or a tunnel under here. Could you imagine? Well, they do oh, say, yeah, that'd be right? cool. They do say there was a tunnel here somewhere. Yeah. We went through hell getting to this place today because we had to endure a hailstorm. You'll see that on my vlog channel. My truck got destroyed. Um, hail the size of golf balls. Never seen it before. And then we had to endure a tornado. Oh, oh a nail. There's the culprit. Mm. Bro, you know what that means. <laughs> We're good luck. <lesson. laughs> if you guys have been following our videos for a long time, Rennie and I, whenever we find nails, magnet fishing, we have good luck. Look at that, another oh, nail. Really? There's no f***ing way. There is no way. Oh, if there is oh, there's something here. Oh, what the hell? Hold on, let me see. Let me get a scan on that. Yep. Yeah, next time we'll definitely bring a better shovel and yeah. pickaxe. Yeah, good idea. A pickaxe might be good too. Break the earth. <laughs> or a ring. <laughs> you know what the problem with this is? You just want to keep going. I know, that's the thing. Because it's you like, you don't know what's that's down what's there. That's what's interesting about these videos. Because like the viewers want to see what the hell we find. And like, it literally gave me a good signal over here. Yeah, 89, yeah. I've never seen an 89 signal for AU, for aluminum. Or silver, we don't know which. <laughs> All right, let's, let's keep moving now. I'll just time lapse this shit. Oh, guys? Yeah? Is that a guy looking at us over there? Where? Where? Down there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is that a guy? What the f*** is that? Where? It was just there, behind the tree. Oh. Is that a guy? Yeah, I oh, it might be. Hello? That's my ankle. You saw a guy, right? I saw him. Andrew, did you see a guy? I did not. I was looking the other way. I don't where Rennie was. I saw him taking Ozzy from him. Yeah, he was right there. It was like a dark figure. It wasn't even a guy, like a dark figure. Yeah. I'm telling you, this thing going crazy for no reason. We saw a dark figure that might be like a freaking shadow figure. Or a shadow man. I am commandeering again. A metal mm -hmm. detector. Rennie's really, like, really anxious to find something himself. I found a couple of things. I mean, he's found a couple of things too. I feel like there actually might be some like things here. Because there's a lot of rocks in this area. Yeah. Anything, Rennie? 
look, 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 look. Come on, camera. Camera. Look, look, look. There's a branch there with writing on it. Hmm. See that? I mean, it could, it could be just kids. Did you actually cut yourself? What did you do? Uh -huh. Oh god. Cut myself on this thing. Look at that. You got a tetanus shot? I don't know. <laughs> Look at that. Oh jeez. Damn. My eyes should have the shovel. <laughs> I was trying to like unearth this like log. It had a name on it. We have a... It looks like it says Vinny. What do you guys think this says? It looks like a Vinny, like an upside down Vinny. Kind of. Who's Vinny? Hey, Vinny. Hey, Vinny, you Al Capone's friend. Where you at? Found it here, though. Fucking oh, hand. Oh. Could have been the shovel. Hang on. No. Nothing. Let's move on. So where I where I thought I seen someone watching us was over there by yeah. the, that tree. Yeah, somewhere in that area. Let's go in over there and see if there's something there. So I'm quickly beginning to realize that near trees is where we're finding things. I mean, it makes sense. People hang out by trees, they bury but things. They use it as a marker as well, you know They I mean? use it as a marker. If someone wants to hide something, they'll know like that tree is where I hid my object. So like, whenever Rennie hides his dildos, he hides them by trees. Very yeah, true. That's true. And he doesn't like wrap them in anything, he just leaves them bare. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of weird. <laughs> At least wrap them up, Renny. Come on. How funny would, would it be if we found a dildo? A metallic <laughs> dildo? Somewhere in this area. I thought I seen something like directly over here. Go go by like a tree yeah. or hang on, it could be underneath like here too. Yeah. That tree looks like a marker though. I mean, they all they all look the same thing. It's all trees. Nothing so far. Hey, there's a weird hole over here. Look. Hey, I, I kid you not, I did not do this. Come, come see this. Come see this. We just got here right now. Look at this. No, look, look, look. look. No, that's a shovel. Now look at this. It's like someone dug a hole here. Yeah. Dude, that's so strange. Ooh. Either, I promise you guys, I promise you guys, I did not dig I this know, hole. I know, but hang on, let me just check, like, just in case. Check, I check for metal. Detector. Yeah, check for metal, that's right. I get, like, carried away. I get excited sometimes. No. Oh. There's no way. Check, just in case. Dig. Hey, are you cut on your chest? Oh, yeah, Ooh, yeah. Sure, yeah. Or no. Oh, that's a big, big mosquito. Mosquito. Oh. Yeah. You got someone else's blood on you just now. <laughs> nasty. Probably yours. <laughs> Probably one of them. <laughs> Something in there. Somebody dug this up before us. Someone was here digging. Yeah, what is that structure over there? It's a it's a it's a shack. Oh. It's an abandoned shack. Yeah. Is it? I don't know. Yeah, I can see it. Dude, let's go check it out. Yeah, you can see like we'll come, we'll come back there. to this area later. Yeah, look, it's an abandoned shack. Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> are you gonna keep are you gonna keep searching there? Yeah, just in case. Okay, okay we'll see you in a few. Dude, it's like a, a whole separate house over here. Yeah. There's definitely lots of metallic items there. We should get Renny to come here with the metal detector. Yeah. I feel like like it, we literally might. Like, look at this. It's a freaking house or a shack or something. Yeah. Like, There's even another name here, Ken. Ken? Yeah, I didn't notice that one the first time. You got a hit? Yeah. Where? Like on the plate? Really? Oh, I just heard that. I heard that over here. Yeah. Okay, yo, come here. Mark the location, come here. I want to see what's here first. Yeah, so I'm going to do the digging because I got blood on the shovel. Okay? Oh, you weren't kidding. Yeah, there's an actual abandoned, destroyed house. I actually found it by that tree that we were at. Really? I keep beeping, yeah. What did you find? Did you, did you look for it? I didn't look for it. Okay, so you can manage that for now. I'll keep the shovel because I got blood on it. Okay. I don't want to contaminate you with my I awesomeness. My I'm over here. There's a hole over here. Okay. I want to see what's over here. There's an actual hole here. This is cool. Like we found an, an abandoned shack in Al Capone's backyard. Dude, get over here. Look, there's a hole there. Yeah, yeah, yeah I see that actually. Oh, oh, what's that? Oh, look, there's a can. It's another can. It's a really Metal, old. Yeah. It's a really old oh, can. That yeah, that's rotten. Oh, yeah. yeah, look, there's tons of like the metal. 
Cancer just stick it in the hole. I want to see if there's anything in the hole. Yeah, stick it in the hole, Rennie. Yeah. Stick it in the hole. <laughs> right in the hole. Right in the hole. I have experience with that. <laughs> We're, we're getting something. Yeah, there's something. Okay, there. let me go over there with the shovel. This is cool. We might actually don't cut yourself again. Cool. I know I'm already. I put some mud on it just to stop the bleeding. The strongest signal I've ever seen on this thing, actually, though, yet was yeah. next to that tree. Really? Yeah. All right. Give me a few seconds to see what we can find here. This hole goes deep. It's just full of leaves. Oh, is this a can? That's an old Coca-Cola can. Dude, I haven't seen a can like this in a long time. Look at that. Hello. That's an old-fashioned Coca-Cola yeah. can. Oh, that's old school. Look at even like the holes on it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three. It had like four holes. Oh, wow, look yeah. at that. That is a cool that's find. Cool pretty cool, yeah. I'm going to leave it right here, so if anybody comes and claims it, they can have it. Do you want it, Rennie? <laughs> All right, here we go. No. I'm just going to leave it here. I wonder if there's anything else. Oh, I found something else. Look at this. What is it? A can of some sort, but not sure what was inside of it. <laughs> it's definitely metal. <laughs> definitely metal. <laughs> oh my god. More of these old Coke cans. There's a like little treasure them. chest. Dude, look at this. Oh, there's a lot of Coke cans actually. Another one? Yeah. Another one. Uh, yeah. Orange Crush. Old Orange Crush. What? That's like from the. 50s or 40s dude it's cool see that my wow. my guess is like these capone guys i don't know i don't know how old those cans are you guys can let me know in the comments well my guess is they would come down here and drink their cokes but then again i'd expect mobsters to drink like hard liquor mm -hmm. there's a good signal here too people even back in the day used to litter a lot but the difference is is back in the day things were made of um metal so yeah, it would but but it, it, it would like a house or something but it would rot away so like metal rots away, you know what I mean? Hey, let me just say metal detecting is fucking hard as Put your back into it. It's good exercise though. It is. It'll be here for like weeks on end. Back in the day. forget where it is though, because I did mark it, but let's just check out like that tree. He really wants us to check out that tree. Fine, Rennie, let's go check out that tree. This. These are old tin cans. Oh yeah. Those are like oil cans. Right? Yeah. It's cool to see how they do. Yeah. No, those are gas cans. Something got set on So I know like we assume everything is evil, but it's a mobster. And he was evil. I don't give a f if you guys are going to like say he wasn't evil. No, homeboy was evil. Maybe he was good to his community, which a lot of people do say. And I agree. Any mobster or gangster like Pablo Escobar, he was good to his community. Al Chapo, he was good to his community. Mo Sarge, he was good to... But they all had people whacked, right? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, where did you say you got a pen here? This tree? Yeah. You guys went down to the shack? Uh, no, it's like at the stump here. On the other side. Where? Hang on. Here. Oh yeah, you're getting a reading right there, right? Yeah, that's the strongest one so far. That's like a hundred reading. 90. Jesus. Alright, let's start digging them in. It's a dead tree. There's like all this corrosion on it. See all this white stuff? It's like all corrosion. When trees die, they get really corroded badly like this. It looks like paint, but it's not. <clears throat> I don't really find anything here. This tree's hollow as fuck. <sighs> oh. Did I hear something? Yeah, yeah. something? I think so. It could be a rock. Should I scan it again? No. Hang on, it's not going now. It's weird. Oh, there oh, it is. There go. Oh, okay. Like right. Oh, yeah, low. Yeah. Yeah. Strongest signal so far. Hold on, I, I, 95, shit. boys. <laughs> I bent my shovel. 95. <laughs> Use your hands if you have to. There's nothing here. It's gotta be something. something. It's the strongest reading we've gotten so far. Yeah, it was a strong reading, but there's nothing here. It's just a f empty tree with some false. Another false alarm? No. I'm tired. <laughs> I'd use the shovel, but your blood's all over oh. it. Oh. <gasps> what? No. F what is it? I don't. I... Give me. Give me something. Give me something. Give you some what? 
What do you, what do you want? There's something here. I wanted something to grab it with. It looks like, like, like a leaf or something. Dude, that's a fucking gun. No. What? That's a fucking dude. That's a fucking gun. No. no. That's what makes a, you think that's a gun? Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh my god. It's a gun. Uh, it's an okay. actual fucking gun. Angelo, come here. Don't come touch here. it. Don't put your finger. No, no, don't, don't, don't put your, put your, your finger. Don't, don't touch it. I'm not gonna touch it. I'm not gonna if you're gonna it. touch it, grab it with a leap. We just found a fucking gun. We just found a gun in Al Capone's backyard. There's hang no on, way. hang on, hang on. I know it's old, but can it fire still a gun like this? That's old, like that. I wouldn't even try it. Yeah. This is Canada. It, oh, it's heavy. We're not used it's, to guns. It's a in real freaking gun. We're not used to guns in Canada. No. Wait, hold on, yeah. hold on. Be, honestly, guys, though, be careful. Don't point this at each other. Put it down. And don't aim it at each other. Yeah, exactly. Put it down. Yeah, that's it. Oh my god, look at that. Look at that reading. Yeah, that's what I'm telling that's you. That's what that we got. The reading, yeah. And look, look at how corroded it is. The same white corrosion as that tree. I don't know how old that is. Well, it looks ancient. I don't know what kind of gun. I don't know anything about guns. I'm Canadian. Yeah, dude, that's crazy. That's awesome. That's freaking crazy. <laughs> how on earth did we just do this? Killed it, man. Just in yeah. case. Yeah, don't point that this way. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> just, know, just, don't, just don't just touch. Leave don't it. put your just finger near the trigger. Don't put alone. your finger near the trigger. Just leave it. We just found a gun. That was scary. The sound of a train. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I heard that. I'm, I'm, but here's what I don't get. Because we thought someone like was standing here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we came over here and we found a gun. We found a chain up there. Like this is a mobster's old hideout. Yeah, but this is an old gun, man. But like, how old is this gun? Like, I don't know anything Ancient. about guns. Maybe some of you guys. How do we even know that's a real gun? Maybe it it's feels a like gun. it's got the weight. It's of heavy. It. Yeah, yeah, it it's is a heavy. heavy gun. Is there any like anything written on there? Here, hold, hold this. Okay, I wish I had like a rag with me or something. <laughs> <laughs> He's right at Angelo, man, man. Watch where you, dip. dude, dude. Careful. It's, it's not aimed at Angelo. I'm aiming it upwards, and I've shot guns before. So it's made in Spain. The rest of it is scratched off. Shit, I got my fingerprints on it now. Well, it's okay, you can wipe them off. I'm kind of stressed out right now. Like, to, <laughs> like it's a f***ing gun. We just found a gun. <laughs> what do we do with it? I have no idea. Do we keep it? Do we take it? Finders keepers. We got to go take this to like a, yeah, to get appraised, you know? Get it checked out. Well, yeah. See if I it's mean, real. <clears throat> Looks and feels real. Uh, every part of me wants to believe that this was Al Capone's gun or, or, or whatnot, but here's the thing. Al Capone abandoned this place like f almost a hundred years ago. Or no, not a hundred. No. How, how long? Like? He died like late 40s, so probably okay. between the 30s and 40s he probably would have been here. Yeah, like yes. I'm willing to bet somebody else came out here over time <laughs> mm -hmm. and planted this gun. It looks like the name says Vinny here on the side. Yeah. See how it's kind of Vinny, there is like v -I a weird inscription. Yeah, and yeah, a yeah. weird looking Y, so it could be Vinny. The trigger back here, should I cock it? Oh boy. Oh look, it turns. Well, it's a revolver, what do you expect? Okay, there's no I bullet. <laughs> there's no bullet in it. Are you, are you clicking the trigger? Yeah, it's jammed, it's, it's jammed. jammed. Dude, it's I mean, a real it's gun. Dirt How much do you think a gun like out. that is worth though? If this is Al Capone's gun, it could be a fortune. Oh dude, Yo, that's could a be a small it, fortune. Yeah. Who wants this gun? Does anybody want it? Highest bidder. Uh, I say we split it. I'll leave. I'll leave my PayPal link down in the comments below. Yeah. The highest bidder oh. will get this gun. Can we list it on eBay? The Is highest okay? bidder will get this gun. I'll leave my PayPal link down below, and uh, let's see. This vid is gonna get demonetized anyways because there's a gun in it. So oh, yeah, let's true. see, guys. Highest bidder. I'll I'll send this gun to you. I don't know if it's real. I don't know what it. Like, I don't know shit about guns. I just know like an M4, M16, RPG. A grenade launcher. That's pretty much it because of Call of Duty and stuff. And I've shot a couple guns in the U.S. This is so f***ing cool, dude. You don't understand. Like, I'm so happy I f***ing stuck here. Just to look. <laughs> what? I'm so happy I f***ing looked around here. How the hell did you find that? Like, look. I told you. So here's the thing. Like, when it comes to metal hunting and shit. Patience, man. Patience. Well, I didn't, we've been out here for hours. But the thing is, people hide stuff near trees. Like, when I was a kid, I used to hide stuff around but trees. But not just that. It's the location, man. Yeah. yeah. It's a marker. How do we know whoever hid this gun? 
didn't put it on by that marker. There's an orange marker on that tree there. You know what I no, mean? No, but the fact that's Al Capone's place, I'm not surprised of the, all the things that we could have found, a gun. I'm willing to bet this is an Al Capone's gun, but we found it in his place. Yeah. But at the same time, it's an old gun. Homeboy had many guns. You never as, know, there might be more guns here. Hang on. Yeah. If you guys want to see looked Tommy pretty thoroughly around here. So I noticed the forest goes way, way back. Like there's acres and acres of land. If you guys want us to do another video another day, I actually have to head back. I think my wife might have a baby tonight or something. She's really pregnant. Um, we're like a week or two away from giving, having a baby. So I got to head back home and be with my wife just in case she does has, have the baby today. Uh, but if you guys want me to come back here and do another video, imagine finding a Tommy gun. <laughs> like crazy. No way in hell. No way in hell. All right, guys, smash the like button. Get yourself some live a little merch. I'm going to leave my PayPal. Whoever wants this gun, I will literally send it to you. Highest bidder. I'll even make a video about it too. So um, just so you guys know like, Wait. No, no, I just turned it on again. Okay, I thought you got more. <laughs> no, no, Wait, maybe sorry. we should circle around it. No, no. For another video. We have to come back for another time. Smash that like button. Love you guys from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for all the love and support. If you guys want to see more videos like this and even haunted ones, although like everybody's doing haunted, like when I first started off doing haunted, barely anybody was doing it, and now everybody's doing it. So for me, it's kind of like demotivating. Not because everyone's doing it, but it's like everything's been done. You know what I mean? Unless like I actually go and find the devil himself, which I really don't want to. I want to go to heaven. I love God. Yeah, Canada only has so many haunted places. Well, we, have you ever been out west? No, we can't go out west because there's a ban on us going west, out west. We can. East, west, we can. East, we can. East, we can. Oh, really? Yeah. That's right. I don't know my geography. <laughs> <laughs> love you guys from the bottom of my heart. Don't forget to be you. Do smash the like button. I'm going to put more updates about this gun on my Instagram page. Um, on the stories, so make sure you guys are watching the stories. If you're not watching the stories, then you should just unsubscribe. Love you guys, be you do, stay positive, and I know I said it again, but live a little.